we're going to climb up to first because the lift <laughs> is really expensive so we're gonna hike up it's and even it's up. more expensive than the trains and the trains are expensive yeah and it's a four hour walk Switzerland is so beautiful. Just look at those mountains back there. Woo. <laughs> and the hike hasn't even started, really. Now is the point. We are getting out of Grindelwald, um, a place where the train left us. And we're now hiking up all the way to the mountain first. You can do it. Come on! Smile! Beautiful! It's one of the best things if you're hiking in Switzerland. There's water everywhere to drink. Just three hours left to first. Ah, looking quite good. And the views also pretty nice. How are you feeling? <laughs> it's so heavy. But we have this incredible view to ourselves. Just two hours and 30 minutes left. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. We thought it would be more still, but we're doing great progress. We are not making any break, we're just pushing on. Tired? Should I take the backpack? Oh, I'll take the GoPro. Want to drink something? No. Oh. It's going smooth. It's not uphill anymore. Woo! We are nearly at the middle station. We are going to look for a fountain so we can fill our water bottles. Hopefully they have one. Tastes good. Ah, but it's not so cold. Actually, pretty warm. Be careful. We are on the last mountain to get to first and just check out these views here. Amazing. Pretty girl with a pretty name, but I'm pretty sure that you're not the same. Feels like you read my mind, and there's more than me the eye. Pretty girl with a pretty name, but I'm pretty sure that you're not the same. Look at this view. Feels like oh. you read my mind, and there's Beautiful. more than me the eye. Oh, wow. Pretty girl with a pretty name, but I'm pretty sure that you're not the same. Feels like you read Meters. 
Head to the top. <laughs> We're now gonna cross this bridge right here. or a woman, not quite sure if it's a guy or a woman, <laughs> did this Eiger Nordwand or North Face in 2 hours two and hours 22 minutes. minutes from down there to up there. I mean, it we climbed this long. up in 4 hours Yeah. <laughs> and he did in half the time to a bigger mountain and you need to yeah. climb 4 kilometers up. going to the Bach Alpsee here 50 minutes from the end station and if it isn't too cold we are going to jump in <laughs> the lake ready to jump in two three Whoa. <laughs> But it's not so cold here outside. It's okay. <sighs> After jumping into the lake, we now have our deserving lunch. break, lunch break. Oh, we have we're starving. Bread. <laughs> bread and cheese. So European. Yeah, and it's the only thing we have. Um, we hiked now for five hours or four and a half hours and we didn't make a real break until now so pretty happy yeah it's so cold we need to get to the sun yeah. so we're leaving our picnic spot and the lake and we're gonna go as fast as we can to the sun. For the sun now we're gonna check the prices uh, to go down in a lift or to do like a cart go-kart thing back down which looked pretty fun <laughs> <laughs> and yeah we're gonna check we checked on uh, google it says it's open until 10.
and all the way to here we went up. Walking. All the way here. Yeah, walking, obviously. From down there, from Grindelwald, all the way to here. We just got we to just this river. Down five meters back there, it's like two degrees warmer. It's oh. Yeah, it's oh. really cold over this river because this river comes from the glaciers. So it's cold. I, I can I can feel the cold. at the glacier canyon do we want to go in yeah let's do this we're entering the tunnel to the glacier canyon the highest point is 300 meters high the canyon and you need 40 minutes to walk uh, to the end and back so yeah so 10,000 years ago Grindelwald Valley was covered by ice. Was covered by ice. Was a big glacier, and well now, now the glacier is going back, and now you have the valley and all these forms of rocks, and yeah, and also this this canyon here. In the 16th century, the glacier was all the way down here, and now it's just up there. So you can see how the glacier is melting and in some years it will be gone. We're sitting, We're sitting. sitting on top of the river! Yeah. <laughs> ah, quite hurts actually. Not quite so cool. Aua, aua, aua. Doesn't it hurt? But we quite scary! No! <laughs> no, it was cool! We went on top of the water only with a net underneath us. Ah! Yeah, it was quite cool. It was quite cool. And the view here is just impressive. Just look at it. Just impressive. During uh, summer, all the water that is running down the river here in Grindelwald is from the glacier. And also all the water that well, lands in the lake down in Kalagu is from the glaciers here on top. And in winter, when it all freezes, well, the water doesn't run down. But in the summer, when it's hot and there's no rainfall, the water comes down again and it's like a really good reservoir from water, you know? And yeah, the climate change is just has losing its balance from winter and summer and that's going to cause a real damage. Wow. Drink from the Eiger. How does it taste? Mm, it's cold. It's cold? Yeah, obviously it's cold. Glacier water. I want to try it. <sighs> Refreshing. You probably cannot see this, but all the way up there, all the way up there, there is a mountain with snow and a glacier. It looks 
incredible. But you can't see it on a GoPro. In the 1950s, here at this point, you could see the glacier. Literally here, in this canyon, from down there to up there, was the glacier. But now, it's two kilometers further down, and it's why it doesn't lead all the way back there. So in just 60 years, the glacier moved two kilometers back down. I still cannot believe that the glacier was right here. Literally, here was a wall of glacier. Literally. And we were talking about that all the things uh, right now are impressive. Yeah, maybe, uh, when maybe when we are, when we are all the 